Google's unofficial slogan has always been, don't be evil, but maybe it should have been, don't be Skynet. Science aficionados will be familiar with Isaac Asimov's three laws of robotics. One, a robot may not injure a human being or through inaction, allow a human being to come to harm. Number two, a robot must obey the orders given by a human beings except when such orders would conflict with the first law. And third, a robot must protect its own existence as long as such protection does not conflict with the first or second laws. Although when it comes to technology, things are never so simple. And there's no doubt that Google has been contemplating these concerns for quite some time. The search giant recently published a paper outlining some practical approaches to solving what may turn out to be one of the most important problems society will face in the coming decades. In their paper titled Concrete Problems in AI Safety, Google is careful to give relatively harmless negative repercussions as examples. A robot attempting to mop an electric outlet, a cleaning AI deciding to cover up messes rather than take care of them, etc. But a failure to solve the control problem actually presents much higher risks, such as an existential catastrophe. Google has identified five subparts of this problem. The big one is avoiding negative side effects, which is essentially making sure that the AI doesn't knock over a vase, or worse, kill a human being. Other problems include avoiding reward hacking, which would prevent an AI from working around its intended task to achieve an easier method of producing the desired result though they differ from the instructor's intent. Next up is scalable oversight, and this addresses how to appropriately monitor an AI without the output of data becoming overwhelming. And safe exploration ensures that AI will be free to search for more creative solutions without violating the, quote, avoiding negative side effects tenet. And lastly, distributional shift. This addresses the concern that an AI's real-world environment will differ substantially from its training environment. Like a college graduate, it will be important for an AI to enter the real world and get a job done and not end up in their mother's basement arguing with strangers on the internet. Yes, I'm looking at you, troll. Today, nearly anything is possible. If you can dream it, your team can build it. Makers of collaboration software that helps your team work better together. Create and share content, organize results with the flexibility of Confluence. They even have instant messaging and video chat with HipChat. You can also manage code in real time with the power of Bitbucket. Visit Atlassian.com and see how Jira, Confluence, HipChat, and Bitbucket can give your team everything they need to succeed. So what are your thoughts and fears about Google AI or just AI in general? Is iRobot our future or are we just overblowing it? Let us know in the comments below.